Hello everybody. In this short video, I will be showing you how to use the new Big Market and Slack integration. The new Big Market Slack integration allows you to send chat messages and Q&A from your Big Market webinar room to a Slack channel. So here we have the Big Market webinar room open. And I'm going to make a split screen to show also the Slack channel. So I have the Big Market webinar room on the left side and I have the Slack channel on the right side. So I'm going to put it here. Actually, I'll put it here, make it more obvious. So I'm going to send a chat from here. I'm going to say, hello, this is a chat. So I'm going to send this message and then this message will be sent to Slack. So I'm now I'm going to respond to a Slack. This is this reply via Slack. As soon as I do this, the message will be sent back to the webinar room. I can also reply via thread. So I'm going to click on via th reply via thread. And it's like, this is a thread reply. And the reason you want to do, and you can see the message shows up here. And the reason you want to do this is if you have multiple webinars linked to one Slack channel, and you don't want this message to go to all the webinars, then you want to reply by thread. This way, this only goes to corresponding webinars and this will be particularly handy if you have a web evergreen webinar running every 15 minutes so you might have webinars that's overlapping so the messages doesn't get sent to multiple rooms um, you can also uh, this also works with q a so let's see if i go to q a right i'm going to ask a question you know what is the weather like in chicago and i'm going to ask the question and you can see the question will show up in Slack. So now with the Q&A, you will have to, and it shows Q&A right here, um, you will have to click on um, reply via thread. Otherwise, if you do it over here on, on the regular message, it's going to reply as a chat. So I'm going to uh, reply as a thread. This is like, the weather is nice here. So I'm going to respond via thread. And you can see the answer will be posted and it will be answered to the corresponding Q&A. So how does this work? How can we set this up inside a big marker? Um, then I'm going to show you how to do that. So to set up the big marker and uh, Slack notification, you just have to go to the Manage Webinar tab and then click on Push Notifications. And here you will see the Push Notification options. Right now there's three options. The Slack notification um, is the one we're talking about here. But you can also do uh, SMS text notification. So send text messages um, to your phone when chat messages and Q&A are submitted and you can respond via the phone, via text message. And you can also do iOS push notification. So if you install a BigMarker app, you can get push notification whenever people ask a question or uh, send a chat. So for Slack, just click on enable Slack relay, click on connect to Slack, and it's gonna ask you to authorize. So you will just authorize after you authorize, you have to choose a channel within Slack. This is very important. You have to do this. Um, and a few things to notice, you have to select a channel that is public within your workspace in Slack. So I'm going to select the Big Marker Slack channel. And if you do any work, do any changes on the Slack side and you want to refetch this list, just click on this refresh list and this will get to pull in any new channels you created on Slack. There's an option here called force reply by thread. And this was uh, mentioned earlier in a video. So if you have multiple webinars going on at the same time, uh, it might be good to turn this on. So what this does is like all responses has to be replied within thread. So you, if you turn that option on, if you type any messages in here, it will no longer get sent back to the webinar room. You will have to click on reply to thread and do all the responses in here. Um, so this is, would be good if you have team members and want, still want to chat in here and you don't want those regular chats to go back to the webinar room. And of course, if you have multiple rooms linked to a single Slack channel, you want to respond by uh, thread so not all messages go back to it. So I'm click on save and now this channel is linked. But there is one very important step you have to do uh, and that is once you are inside, uh, you link this channel, 
um, you will have to go to click on the members and you will have to add the big market app to this channel otherwise the, the channel slack channel will not have the permission to receive and send messages so you can see here i already added it but if you haven't added it just click on invite more people and type in big marker and the app will show up and once it shows up you can do um, all the sending and receiving that you like